On the local sports scene, Matt Wessel is the middleman between the Milwaukee Bucks and the media. Bucks PR, this is Matt. The PR rep compiles notes to make sure reporters know the keys to the game. Yeah, bye. But they're not the only notes or keys in Wessel's life. Well, I've been playing the piano since I was five. It's always been a passion of mine. I even started writing music when I was in high school. That's when a personal tragedy turned his passion into purpose. The music that I write now, it really started with my dad. With me. Journey with cancer. I he was diagnosed with brain cancer when I was a freshman in high school. He battled it for two years and passed away when I was a junior. When I started writing songs just as a therapeutic way of escaping the, the sorrow and dealing with the loss. and um, have been writing ever since. Walk beside me when I am But as his composing progressed, Matt learned he was touching others with his talents. And in the last decade, he's released seven CDs and performed countless concerts. The common theme, a message of support. Music evokes a lot of different emotions and the music that I write plays to a certain emotion and that's targeting people that are dealing with adversity, that have dealt with loss, uh, that are confused, maybe angry, feel alone. Most of Matt's performances take place in Illinois, where he's from, and right here in Milwaukee. He never charges admission, just asks for donations. And in his time singing and performing, he's raised $190,000 for cancer research. I've seen people get so much enjoyment out of the music, and, and they truly do appreciate it, and, and they like listening to it, that that motivates me enough to, to keep doing it. But it's not even his full-time job. The 26-year-old must balance his love of harmony and his love of hoops. When you have something that drives you like music does for me and the Bucks do for me, it's, it's actually pretty easy to, to do both at the same time. You, you find the time to do it. If it means staying up till 2 in the morning, editing music, and getting up at 6.30 to start prepping for a game, you do it because you love to do it. His experiences have also forced some perspective. Sports are sports. Sports are a game. And you realize that there's so much more to life outside of winning or losing a basketball game. My happiness doesn't necessarily hinge upon whether or not we win or lose a basketball game because I've been through things that are beyond that. Jen Latta, Fox Sports.